Tony, there's some real money in the room. Since you've been in porn, have you been in any uh, relationships? I am in a relationship, absolutely. Oh. I am. Oh, I am madly in love with my Obama. <laughs> okay, so you got your an Obama. I do, I do. I, that is his nickname. I named him that. I, we've been together four years now, and we have an amazing relationship. We fucking are mature. We are in a mature relationship where we can talk about things, have boundaries, and enjoy our lives separately and together, baby. It goes down. Mm-hmm. Is he in the industry? He is not. He is very Obama-ish, very square. Mm -hmm. The very opposite of me, baby. Oh, but when we in the bedroom, oh my, oh my, oh my goodness. Yeah, no, we're different. We're swingers, we're beautiful. We love to enjoy life. Like, it's just nice. Yeah, so how did you meet this guy? Avian. <laughs> Was it Avian? It was one of the conventions. It might've been Chicago, Exotica. I don't know. He came by my booth a few times, a couple years in a row. And I guess I didn't notice him at first. I did, he was very handsome. Oh my goodness, he was a very handsome young man. But, so I guess I noticed him, but I didn't really notice him. So he came back a couple years later and kept trying and eventually we went on a date. And um, yeah, we've been together ever since. I think that was four years ago. Oh wow. I think he might contest and say five, but I think it was four that we were together. So does, does it get awkward for you being in a relationship and him seeing, you know, what I'm saying? Oh, no. Again, that's why we are. I said, did I say that? A mature relationship, baby. That's what that's called. And if you are confused about that, then you are just not mature. Right, 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 right. Oh. It's about communicating. It's about having boundaries. It's about, you know, letting the person know what you want. So if you don't know how to talk to the person or. Yeah, you can't make it, baby. Yeah, because, you know. And trust. Oh, my God. The biggest thing, trust. Which, oh, I've been sucking at that lately. But I'm going to get better, babe. I promise. Mm. <laughs> sucking at that trust. Mm. Well, no, but, yeah. It's a big, big, big thing. Yeah, well, m my thing is, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, it, I try to know myself. But it's like, damn, you you know, you want this girl. She's, she, you know, she a porn star, so she good in bed. She does everything you want, you well, know what I'm saying? It, and she yeah. got the Misty Stone effect. But it's like, it's like, damn, like once you done had that, a lot of people get insecure and then want to keep it to themselves. Oh, I see. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, some people have fetishes. <sighs> and yeah, we are into fetishes. We're just different, we're sex people, you know? I live in a sexual world and again I have this mature relationship so that is not an idea in our head baby it is not a a jealousy situation or oh that was good hold on mm. <coughs> baby yeah it is not a jealousy situation it's not no why would he get jealous if anything it turns him on baby <laughs> we disrespectful yeah it's to total opposite mm -mm, we in a mature relationship we grown folks over here and i like the way you are eating her and he liked the way i'm sucking that it is amazing and matter of fact let's just bring it all together and have a whole party yeah Amen. Mm. <laughs> nice. yeah it is it is it's oh, very nice. oh my god oh my god <laughs> yes. well when did you go from Misty Stone to Misty the Legend? That's a good question. At some point in your career, you reached a threshold to where you are no longer just a regular mm -hmm. actress. You're now a porn star. Maybe when I start bringing out other girls who became super, super stars. Are you familiar, familiar with Tiana Trump and Chanel Hart? I am. Okay, so these are some of my babies. So I'm also a mentor who is, oh, and actually my mentor is Roxy Reynolds. So, you know, a, we come from a whole line of, you know what I'm saying? We, we some fly we motherfuckers. Some bitches in the game. <laughs> we some of the bad, yeah, we some motherfuckers. We come from, first of all, we started with the Jordan of the game. <laughs> then we went to Holly Berry. Then we got the GOAT. Miss Tiana Trump, what is it? We got to only vote for the, the, the Tiana Trump or something like that. She Fly. And Chanel killed the game. She was disrespectful. She was amazing. Just period. So even when she got super thick, it was like, oh my goodness. So I don't know. Um, and and even before Roxy, Roxy had a, a friend named Vita Valentine who actually is the one 
who was her best friend and they kind of discovered me. Like Vita was the one who really was hands on with me mm -hmm. and Roxy kind of kept me going when Vita left. Does that make sense? Right. You know who Vita Valentine is? Yeah, I've heard of her. All uh, right now, that is, that's my mentor. So I maybe because I come from a long line of bad and I'm mentoring and then one day somebody was like, oh my gosh, yeah, when you're it, a legend. Or, or maybe it was after my uh, Hall of Fame. No, it was before the Hall of Fame. It was definitely before the Hall of Fame. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know, maybe, I don't really know when it came in, baby, but it came in and it was wonderful and I embraced it and took all the awards and put them on my mantle and that's what it is. Well, I, I can agree though with I don't know when you became the legend since I remember I don't you know being a legend. You know, I don't know either. I don't remember. Uh, you know what I'm saying? But I, I remember arguing with your left hand man, and um, I was explaining to him how Kanye is one of them people yes. because of what he did with good music and bringing mm -hmm. in people like Big Sean. So the fact that you've brought in some oh. of the uh, goats of the game currently, uh, matter of fact, we were having a conversation about. Uh, my little brother, uh, Lee Davis. Okay. And um, how, you know, he was in the pen and he was like, well, how much does the Misty Stone pictures go for? Now, nah, oh, right now. Ironically, right now, mm. the top um, the, the top picture of the game, in the game, you I'm talking, you might can get $10. And in jail, $10 is a lot of money yeah, for of a Tiana Trump uh, picture. So how did that relationship come about? In oh my goodness. How did it come about? I don't, I don't even know if I should say. I don't remember. <laughs> I plead the fifth. Should I plead the fifth on this one? Yeah, I just met her and she was wonderful. And then I, I, I molded her and I loved her and, and she became a superstar. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I gotta keep this one a little. Yeah, I don't remember. I, I don't remember. <laughs> See, I already gave up too much free game. Can't give up too much. Let me let me ask a better question. Let me ask a better question. I what what made you choose her? Ah, oh, she was so fucking beautiful. God damn it. I seen a star. I know when I see a star. And I just knew her charisma, the way that people gravitated to her, the way that they kind of gravitate to me. Oh, uh, I, I, I know a star when I see one. You dig what I'm saying? And she was just a bad fucker. And I knew. I just knew. I just know. I'm a smart b I know. Yeah, we went to parties and she hung out with me and we did a lot of traveling and eventually she was a star too. Okay, well, salute, salute mm -hmm. Trump. Salute well, sometimes Trump. they want to, you know, flap their wings and leave me, so I get a little sad. I miss you guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I'm proud of you. Yeah, well, I'm proud of you. Mm. Well, you know thank what I'm you. saying? Hey, real tone, there's some real money in the room.